Hi, I'm Cherie Colopy, Director of Elementary Curriculum and Instruction. And I'm Adam Cirillo, the Director of Secondary Curriculum and Instruction, and we wanted to share some information about the changes to remote learning and how it will work this school year. The period of crisis learning in the spring caught us all off guard and was a challenge for families, students, and teachers. We have worked this summer to design an improved learning experience for all students. Teams of teachers have been planning throughout the summer, adjusting their work as guidance changed. Based on feedback gathered from parents, students, teachers, and administrators, we've created expectations and a plan for instruction that will look and feel different from the crisis learning of the spring. Our plan for the return to school is focused on building connections and community, creating positive routines and habits, providing access to our teachers, and supporting the needs of all of our students. At the primary and elementary levels, preschool through fifth grade, teachers will share a weekly schedule, which will remain similar for each week of remote learning. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday will operate on the daily schedule, while Wednesday's schedule will be condensed. Having a regular and consistent schedule allows for the development of routines, provides students access to their teachers each day, and supports regular opportunities to provide intervention. Each day will begin with a morning meeting via Zoom. This sets aside time to build relationships important to learning and establishes a routine for our students. As the year begins, teachers will be focusing on getting to know you activities for the students to get to know their teacher as well as their classmates. Teachers will also use this time to ensure students are set for the day of learning and understand the expectations and assignments. Several learning blocks will make up the rest of the school day. These blocks will include instruction in literacy, math, content, and integrated arts. Teachers will deliver instruction, share instructional videos, provide learning activities, meet one-on-one -on -one with students or in small groups, support guided practice and independent work, as well as provide support to students in real time. Some of this time will be live via Zoom, while other parts of the time will be spent with students completing activities on their own. These blocks provide a structure and an access to teachers in a way that was not present in the spring and will help support students as they learn. At the secondary level, students will have a consistent schedule throughout the period of remote learning. Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday will operate on a familiar daily schedule. On Wednesdays, students will engage in an abbreviated schedule in the morning. This schedule provides a framework for healthy routines, including time for independent work, daily access to teachers for students, and opportunities to provide targeted support. Students in grades 6 through 12 will be expected to attend the beginning of each class with their teacher via Zoom every day. By starting the class with their teachers each day, we hope to build the necessary relationships important to learning while creating healthy habits and routines for our students. Our teachers will be able to plan to deliver instruction, facilitate collaboration with classmates, and provide support to students in real time. Our plan will provide access to our teachers in a structured way that was not present in the spring and improve the overall learning experience for our students, families, and teachers. It is not our expectation that students be connected to Zoom all day. Students will only need to be connected to their classrooms via Zoom as long as their teachers need them for instruction, or for as long as the student needs additional support. In many cases, based on the learning activities for the day, students may only need to be connected for a small period of time. This will likely provide additional opportunities for students to ask questions to their teacher outside of whole class instruction, and to receive additional small group support as needed. For students at all levels, Google Classroom will be the hub for learning and function as the virtual classroom. Teachers will be adding students to their Google Classrooms prior to the start of school. Students will find their classes in Google Classroom once this has happened. Teachers have organized their Google Classrooms in a similar format by level to streamline the student experience. The Zoom links will be included in each teacher's Google Classroom. We recently learned that the arrival of our new Chromebooks would be delayed. This has impacted our ability to provide a device for each student to begin the school year. Our plan is to distribute a device to every student as soon as possible. But to start the school year, the district does currently have enough devices to provide a Chromebook to students who are in need of one for remote learning. We are recommending that each student have a reliable device to use for their learning. 
If your student needs a device, please complete the request form. The return to school this August will be much different than the period of crisis learning in the spring. Although the 2020-2021 school year presents a number of challenges for everyone, we are committed to re-engaging students in their learning and moving them forward. The social-emotional well-being of our students is critical. We believe the daily access to teachers and classmates that we have described will allow for the building of community in our classrooms, as well as support the connection that we all know is essential for learning. We are fortunate to have technology that our staff and students can leverage to build these relationships and supports in our remote environment. As with the start of each school year, there will be a gradual transition as students, families, and teachers adjust to our current normal. We will be building community, developing relationships, and getting acclimated to the virtual learning environment. We are committed to supporting the needs of all of our students. Our plan to return to school provides a framework with simple, consistent, and healthy routines that will connect the learning community and provide a structure to support access to our teachers for our students. Please visit the Centerville City Schools website for additional details and an updated frequently asked questions. Thank you.